Hello and welcome to the 11 a.m. Tropical Storm Isaias update. Uh, the power outage situation is really starting to ramp up just to the south of us. Uh, the latest advisory we have, let's get the latest advisory on Tropical Storm Isaias. Uh, and it's still pretty significant. So as of 11 a.m., uh, center of Isaias is moving rapidly across eastern Maryland. Uh, as of 11 a.m., location 39.1 north, 76.1 west, about 20 miles south-southwest of Fredericktown, Maryland, about 70 miles southwest of Philadelphia. Maximum stain winds are still 70 miles an hour. Its movement is north-northeast at 20 miles an hour. Uh, no, north-northeast at 35 miles an hour. This thing is really racing. Minimum essential pressure, 993 millibars or 29.33 inches. We're under a tropical storm warning. Uh, and the tropical storm force winds extend outward up to 140 miles from the center. And a gust to 65 miles an hour was reported at Ocean City, Maryland. And a sustained wind of 45 miles an hour was reported at Ocean City, South Beach in New Jersey. Um, and uh, we're going to uh, look at uh, some of the observations in the area right now. So... Uh, we're, of course, we're under the tropical storm warning. I think we're also under a tornado watch. I think under a tornado watch too. Let me let me see. That's the radar, but we'll. Are we under a? To I think we are under a tornado watch as well. Uh, we are under a tornado watch. Yes. All right. So we're under a tornado watch as well, um, because again, we're in that northeast part of the storm, uh, and there's the chance of tornadoes because of that. Here is the feeder band coming in. You can see a lot of flash flood warnings in effect for the heavy rain. And uh, these are tornado warnings. So it looks like tornado warning for Ocean County now uh, for this uh, area here. And this is all rapidly moving right toward us. Uh, and uh, the power outages are really ramping up. So uh, looking at the outages, North Carolina yesterday, 254,610. It's over for them. Virginia is wrapping up, but they have 317,880 power outages, mostly in the eastern part of the state here, uh, and quite a bit in some of these counties here. Uh, quite a large power outage impact. Uh, and uh, let's take a look at uh, Maryland. Uh, let's take a look at uh, Delaware has 54,000 out. Uh, Maryland has 89,000 out. Uh, as we go into New Jersey, there's already over 100,000 people without power, mainly in the southern part of the state. So it looks like Cape May has 14,780. Uh, Atlanta County has over 20,000. Ocean County has ne nearing 15,000. Uh, Burlington County, 27,000. So we're going to start seeing these power outages ramp up from south to north. Uh, right now on Long Island, there aren't too many, only 987. But if we go and we look at JCP and L, they have 57,663, and it looks like a lot of them are in Tom's River right now. So um, let's see if we can get in here and look at Tom's River. So it looks like a good part of Tom's River has no power already. Um, there's a large outage here in, um, yeah, these are all uh, probably transmission-related outages. Um, uh, this whole area is going to go without power, probably most of it, um, you know, or a good part of it will lose power. Just like a good part of our area will lose power, I'm hoping that doesn't happen in Mineola, but uh, chances are we're going to see, uh, there's a good chance we're going to see some power outages. Uh, like I said, the storm is just starting uh, to get really bad in this area, um, and you can see just lots of red dots all over the map here. Um, 15,000 here, uh, so they're literally whole towns without power already, uh, as a JCPNL's transmission system seems to be failing already um, so um, looking at the radar here's the radar this is the storm you can see that feeder band already literally just off to the south already this thing is just moving so fast it's moving faster than than, than even we thought I mean the worst is going to be here in like an hour it's going to start getting really bad um, uh, see these uh, these heavy uh, Heavy cell, heavy cells that are. It looks like one is just off to the south now of us. So this is the other radar here that I showed you. Here is the satellite of Isaias uh, as it's booking its way up the east coast. Uh, let me go to the observations here again. So here are the observations, and this is why it's so bad. Uh, Miller Air Park, southeast wind at 37, gusting to 54. 
Uh, now here on Long Island, we're just seeing gusts now coming into the 30 mile per hour range. Um, yeah, but look at this, uh, Atlantic City Airport, south southeast wind at 40, gusting to 66. So right now, these high winds are definitely verifying, uh, and we're going to start seeing the winds ramp up within the next hour or so uh, here in this range here, 50 to 60 mile an hour gusts. Uh, um, and if you look at uh, Delmarva, uh, the winds have already come down there a little bit, a little bit. Uh, but you can see the winds are from the west. So you see where the center is. The center is actually moving into New Jersey as we speak. So this thing is really moving fast, and it's going to be through here so fast, but it's going to cause a lot of problems. So that's going to wrap up this update. Again, be safe, be careful out there. Uh, this is going to be a, a quick hitter, but it's going to be intense.